What's up guys, Nepenthes here, and welcome back to another episode of the Draft 2 Glory. Of course, we left the Draft to Glory account because Draft to Glory got too easy, and uh, we didn't have a connection to the account, but EA released the Winter Draft, and this is amazing. I know you guys have already been in the game and seen this, but uh, for playing one, you get a draft token pack, just playing one game in FIFA. We've then got play one foot draft, play two foot drafts, uh three sorry four six and ten for some more rewards and then win one three five ten and twenty for some more rewards so every time we accumulate a reward throughout this uh videos over the next few days we will open them with our actual draft rewards and today we're going to start with the free draft token and just see what we can do i think this is brilliant from ea i wish that they would give this uh, as an l anus I prefer those dub anuses. Um, I I wish that yeah, it would give us more content like this, especially uh, around the draft as well, because as you guys well know, the draft is one of my favorite areas of the game. And uh, we're going to start with our formation. 4-2-3-1 I do quite like. Obviously, sucks because most of the better players are center forwards. Do you know what? We never use Al Jaber. He looks like he could be a bit of fun. We've got Bailey Marino, Son, and uh, Joe Cole. Four-star, four-star, Andre. He's going to go into left-back, isn't he? Yeah, if he just went onto the bench, I would take him. Son does go onto the bench. Ooh. I'm going to take Son. And hope that we just get a better striker than Al Jaber we have. Oh, oh, we have. We have got the king himself. Thierry Henry. I don't care whoever else was there. Four star, four star, six foot two with the Hunter Kemp style, 99 acceleration, 99 sprint speed, 99 finishing. They've done him a little bit dirty on his balance. What happens there? Like, what did somebody like walk near him and he just falls over? Um, however, Titi Ongoy is there. We've got the Zidane perhaps. No, but this draft is already looking quite tasty. The upgraded Davy Clarson. Good card. He had a decent World Cup as well, to be fair. Uh, Florian Verts, I didn't like. Reina, bit meh. Park Ji Sung's quite interesting, but we never really get this Aloe Iran. And so we're going to take... Oh, this is just such a good card. He's not got the perfect chem style on, passing and physical, but it's also not a bad one. So we'll pop him in at cam there and go for the next one. And we'll take... Uh, we'll take Pellegrini. It doesn't really matter on those ones. The next cam, here we go. Ooh. Mario Goetze, quite interesting. I have Ertz, quite interesting as well. Four star, four star, and have Ertz. But I, I do like his in game stats as well. Rodriguez, we don't really care about. Reyna, I don't really care about. The other connections would be either Verts or um, Goetze. Both four star, four star. Goetze has got great dribbling. So has Florian Verts. Although. Reactions and composure are a little low, 86 stamina. Reactions are the same. Less stamina, way better composure. I'm going to go with uh, Mario Goetze. Why not? Why not? Is it not really a player that we've used because he was an SBC that we didn't pick uh, pick up? We haven't got any connections to him here, unfortunately. We take Calvin Phillips. Quite easy to link. We'll take Dorsch there as well. A German from the same league with a shadow chem style too. He's a bad player we are going to have to improve on. But, oh dear. It always just goes wrong, doesn't it? Out of nowhere most of the time as well. I really don't want Cash or Traore. I'll take Vasquez. I think he's got the easiest chance to be linked somewhere else down the line. See what I mean? What is this? Like, what happened, man? Henri... Alawaran, Goetze, and then just garbage. Hey, that's better. Denzel Dumfries or Fofana, no links. Thiago Silva does get the one link. We'll go with him. Am I really... That is an awful, awful draft now. I had the highest of hopes. I'll put Yashin in there. I had the highest of hopes. We need three new midfielders and three new defenders. 
we have already been done so dirty. Oh, EA. We'll take Gulashi for the rating, but Yashin is going to stay in goal. All right, that's a bit better. Do we go with Guerrero, Bundesliga? I do like him. I might even take him, start him on the bench and sub him into the DM role or just start him at DM. Oviedo not interested in. Beghorst not interested in just because he's too hard to link. And also he's garbage. So we will take Guerrero. We do gain one chem point with Guerrero in the team as well, which isn't so bad. All right. We've only got uh, Henri to link Mendy to. Oh, no, we've also got the other... <laughs> I'm sitting there with two other Real Madrid defenders, and I'm like, I've only got Henri. No. <laughs> stupid. Very stupid. Now I will start Guerrero in here. That's much, much better. Now we've just got a few players to figure out. What are we going to get here? Davy Clarsen came through again. Adams would be all right if I could get some chemistry on him. But now that we're taking out the Premier League players, I just kind of can't. So I think we're going to go with Klaassen and pop him in that cam roll. And the next pick... We've got to go with Chong for that 99 shooting, haven't we? Bring, do you know what? I'm not even going to bring him on as a sub. We're just going to start him in, the, in a cam. None of them get chemistry anyway, so what difference does it make? There you go. That's what I was looking for. It's a shame that their centre forward's not cams. It's a shame that there's no opportunity to position change them. But we will take Pele, the the king, the king of football. In he goes. I will take uh, Bergvine as a sub as well. Okay, I just need I just need like a DM, a good DM. Oh, do you know what? David clarson has got really good stats. We lose some chemistry there, but I actually think he's just better. What have we got? Oh. Oh! I don't even know who to take. Mbappe. I never use Mbappe. I'm taking Mbappe. We never get... The this team... I know the chemistry is a bit meh. But the team... Like, look at stats boost. Henri, great chem style. Mbappe gets no chem boost. Who cares? He's insane. Pele gets no chem boost. Who cares? He's insane. Alawiran gets the chem boost. Big boost on strength, which is nice. Big boost on passing, which is nice. Guerrero gets no chem boost, but his stats are actually still very good. Same as David Clarsen. They're decent enough. They're better than what we had. Mendy gets a sentinel chem boost, which is nice. Thiago Silva gets no chem boost. That's a bit of an issue. Vallejo gets a chem boost, but is garbage. Vasquez gets a chem boost. Isn't awful, but isn't great. We do need a little upgrade on that on one of the defenders, really. Take Anthony for the bench. I will take Anthony for the bench. Two more picks. Come on, EA. One good centre back. That's mad, isn't it? I've almost got to take Rude Hullet and play him. At centre back, have I? <laughs> Mate, his defensive awareness and his slide tackles are poor. He can't play at centre back. He's just not good enough. He can play at DM though, or at full back. What's his defensive stats? 83 interceptions, 82 defensive awareness. I'm going to play Hullet at right back. And then last but not least. Take Memphis to pie. I like him. I mean, this is a wild draft. I just don't have any defensive options, like quality defensive options. Hey, Hullet at fullback. What is this, FIFA 19? And the, the reason why I just wouldn't play him at centre-back is because he's got 79 defensive awareness and 81 interceptions. It's just not good enough. Vallejo has almost the same defensive awareness and interceptions. Now, Brazilian manager would be ideal, but I'd also go with a Spanish or La Liga manager. Okay. 12 chemistry on the draft. Why not? Let's do it. 
This guy, Dresden SC, 88 rated, 21 chem. Ah, do not know how chemistry system works. Oh, love it. Here we go. Killian. Into Pele Henri. Oh, it's liquid football. And give it to the king. Give it to the king. Let's go. Oh, oh this, this guy's searching. That's on real. Hey. Yes. Yes. Oh, oh, mate, you're kidding me. At last. At last. Killian. Killing them with a million, Mbappe. Oh, referee, have a word. Hey, menus. Should have done it 1-0, mate. Menus. Into game two we go. All right. The dynamic lights. In goal. Donnarumma. Left back. Luan Perez. In a right back is Sergi Roberto. That's a nice attack, though, isn't it? Doesn't matter, though. I've got a rude hullet. Wow, that's jammy as hell, that is. Mate, Pele just don't miss, does he? Pele just don't miss. Let's go. And you have to say it was on the cards. It was on the cards. And now Henri. 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 That's it. Let's go, baby. Thierry Henri. Thierry Henri. Bops is away. Yes, now. Hey, it's three. Menus, mate. Should have done it 1-0 like the last guy. You would have saved yourself some time and some pain. Oh, lovely. Thierry Henry with a goal of dreams. Look at that. Oh, just straight in there and then the power shot. Boom. You can't give him that sort of space, mate. All right, two and oh. The semi-final. Here we go. BWCFC. He's got Butland. Generic back line, cracking attack, good midfield. Oh, this is a sweat. This is a sweat. Even with a ball roll like that and turn, turn and whatnot like that, they know what they're doing. Do you know what I mean? Come on, Henri. Come on, Henri. Go on, Henri. He's moving his keeper as well. Mate, this is a proper sweat, this. Oh, that'd be it. I don't have the legs in defence. Ah. Mate, this guy's moving his keeper straight away. Holy. How long is this inside for Cole go for? I'm going to try that. I reckon that's uh, potential. Come on, Rude Boy. Come on, Rude Boy. Come on, Rude Boy. Let's go. Let's go. Penrith! No way! Penrith! Hey, he can't keep just, like, doing that to a Bappe, man. I've got past him twice now. Oh, brilliant. Come on, EA, man. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in the... Oh, Stuart, opportunity... All right, there's one back. Come on. The ball is rolling again, and still plenty for the Trojans to fire at. Can they come up with another goal? Uh, can they create something? It's just, it's just genuinely. He's done. Oh, getting the ball forward. Mbappe. And this would reduce the deficit. Come on. Oh, that is it. Clinically. 
That's a joke, man. Oh, this game. Delivering it. Under real pressure defensively. Will they pay the price? I deserve a cheesy goal like that, man. I can't believe this game. I can't believe I lost that game, guys. That, he was a good player, man. He was a good player. But I got absolutely robbed. Either way, let's go and get our rewards. What do we get? A jumbo premium goal pack and a gold players pack is not bad. But we also get some of these draft objectives. I think three we completed. Yeah, so we get play one, play two, and win one. Which means we get another token. Always nice. We need just a few more now to get the uh, the upgrade pack, the 83 by 25. We get ourselves a ones to watch Schlotterbeck, which isn't bad, of course. Could be used in some uh, some squads. It's a managerial masterpiece or something. Hopefully he goes on a mad run and gets some big upgrades. And last but not least, we also get an 80 plus by five players pack. Of course, with not a lot other than winter wild cards in packs right now, I would probably be saving packs until Friday uh, for the new promo. But uh, let's see. Obviously, we're going to make profit here because we've got the draft token for quote unquote free, right? We get an Italian goalkeeper from. Oh, it's a walkout. It didn't even show the uh, the walk animation. That's a mad pack. Cheeky or Donnarumma for like twenty seven k. Justice, that is. Justice. EA knew they screwed me in the game, so they gave me some good stuff. And like 7k for uh, Iago Aspas as well. Um, this can all go. The chem stars I'll keep. The coins I'll keep. Hope and Gomez can go. And the kit is not worth anything. We'll open ourselves a gold players pack as well. A lot of gold players are actually worth quite a bit right now as well. Uh, because of the SBCs. Um, none of these guys, though. That's too bad. Let's just list these guys up. And then to end off with for today, guys, we've got the 80 plus by 5. Let's see if we can get anything good out of it. We get lights up. Spain, left wing. This time we get an 84. Oh, Yazabal. Not bad. And the draft, even though that game was stressful, that guy was good. I do, I do feel like I got a bit cheesed out of it, but GG's to him. And uh, that's going to be the end of the video. So thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.